Hey guys, Silence here, here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross Gacha video. And this time around, as you can see on the banner on the main screen right now, it belongs to Kaname. So if you guys have been following me on my YouTube Facebook page, uh, link is in the description down below. Make sure you follow that page because that's where I usually upload any Uta Macross information, including Pokemon Masters, if you guys are following me for Pokemon Masters as well. Um, yeah, any information that I do not make into a video, um, that needs immediate translations and immediate attention usually I'll post it up there so make sure you guys follow me there on my YouTube Facebook page link is in the description once again so anyway guys we're gonna talk about Kaname's brand new episode plate and of course we're gonna see how it fares compared to Mikumo's and of course to see whether it's actually worth your singing stones or not if not maybe you might want to hold back on it because well, you can eventually unlock uh, Kaname's costume uh, in future free to pull gachas, I suppose, if her episode plate uh, happens to be within the pull list of episode plates from those free gachas. So let's take a look at the episode plate and let's break down the stats of this episode plate like we always do. And of course, um, we're gonna see whether this episode plate belongs to a particular tier level uh, in terms of usefulness so total of 3602 based on its plus 25 luck value so it should be i think the estimated it will be around uh, 3004 or so when it's not with the plus 25 luck so focusing on charm uh, which is what basically this current event song requires a new stream requires charm stats to actually give you the very good high score and here's an interesting thing that we've never seen before a center skill that only activates when it's used on a heart or pink element song so that's a first of its kind just like Mikumo is also uh, including a first of its kind a brand new active skill uh, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about make sure you go watch my previous gacha video regarding uh, Mikumo's episode play itself so yeah so love Element songs, um, units total is boosted by 25% up. So 25% up is not fantastic. Um, so definitely to say, Kanami's episode plate is not meant to be used as a center position, but it's more like a live support um, as uh, episode plate use as sidelines for high score purposes and all that kind of stuff. So active skill, it does have an S rank active skills, life recovery of 50%. So I guess Kanami's episode plate can be used um, for the second event of the month which is usually mission clearing that maybe requires you to finish the song with a certain amount of HP at the end of the life you know to gain those extra bonus points live skill score repeat so score repeat it means that this episode plate is meant to be used for long duration song which is just exactly what new stream is because it is a pretty long song um, and yeah so at, uh, for every 30 seconds it activates for 7 seconds and of course you get a 80% score boost so let's go check out the last page which is the most important one to see whether um, this episode plate will maybe reach around tier 2 or even tier 2.5 you know because if it does have a special note attached to it it's definitely going to be a tier 2.5 but if it doesn't have anything at the end then sadly to say Kaname's episode plate is going to stay into tier 2 Alright, so at the last page, sadly to say, no special notes attached to the episode plate. So Kaname's plate is going to be tier 2. Now, the thing about this tier system right now that I'm using, I'm going to reformat the whole thing because I know it's a bit confusing, like from tier 2 to tier 2.5, then it goes to tier 1. It's pretty confusing. It's not numerically correct. So guys, I've actually created a poll on my YouTube Facebook page um, that once again link is in the description um, whether you guys want me to you know finalize a tier system and of course to uh, grade most of the general new episode plates that are you know within uh, competitive play level or hardcore play level so that you guys can pay attention to them whenever they uh, resurface in um, gachas you know that kind of stuff so that you can focus your singing stones in terms of trying to obtain them instead of you know um, trying to guess or maybe to pull every single gacha that ever comes out and then you end up wasting your singing stones because an important episode play appears later on 
(um) that you might need for your high score achievements and especially now that we have the brand new Utah grade system um, that video um, about me breaking down version 3.1.0 and Utah grade is available on my YouTube channel under the playlist for Utah Macross tutorials go check that out as well uh, I'll probably leave it as a link in the end of the video uh, like I always do so guys um, go watch those videos, there are plenty of videos with a lot of information regarding Utah Macross and its latest updates and of course, um, you know, all the gachas that we've ever encountered in the last two and a half years of Utah Macross. Yes, Utah Macross is getting old, so am I. So anyway guys, uh, let's get down to pulling the gacha. I'm just gonna use 300 singing stones because Kanami's episode plate isn't that fantastic in terms of stats or usefulness. It is pretty okay. Um, if you're looking to get you know a replacement for a hard element plate that has a life skill that boosts high score for long duration songs kind of miss episode plate is definitely up your alley you might want to consider getting it but of course if you're a Kanami fan well why are you holding back on just go get your waifu's episode plate already <laughs> so anyway guys let's do the gacha pool and hopefully enough um you know Kanami might bless me with something nice because you guys know how horrible my gacha pools are and we rarely rarely see um, very nice pools most of the time they all ended up being free gacha pools so <laughs> all right so we didn't really see any loading so that's kind of a sad note to begin with oh we do get two red boxes at the first blink uh, and second blink stays the same so hopefully the two red boxes or at least one of them might evolve i'm just hoping so uh, no evolution on the first one. Oh god, we've got an episode play with Misa looking sad. That's that's a very bad omen. <laughs> okay, so I don't know whether I'll get an episode plate for Kanami, but I'm just hoping to get at least a few episode plates that has her costume points so, can, so I can at least have the option to unlock the costume with your episode orbs if required. Um, but I am definitely not in a hurry to unlock Kanami's costume or Mikumo's costume. Eventually, they might come to me through free gacha pool. So there we go, the red box didn't evolve, so that's kind of a bummer. Uh, but I've been seeing, I've been seeing a lot of um, Nikomo Star Singer episode played recently. I I don't know why that is. Maybe Nikomo has, I mean, the Star Singer form maybe has some kind of uh, affiliation with me. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, that's kind of a sad looking episode played for Misa. She's she's not happy in, in, in both versions of the uh, image. It's like the pre-evolved one was like repressed and then now that it's evolved, it's like depressing and saluting Hikaru. <laughs> it's very depressing. Oh god. Why 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 did Dana create such an episode plate? <laughs> okay, so <laughs> guys, um as usual, hopefully you guys have uh, awesome pulls compared to mine. I know Sabrina has gotten a, a, a very awesome pull. She did pull out Kaname's episode plate on her first 300 stone pull. So uh, kudos to you Sabrina. And of course if you guys want to let me know how you guys do it, uh, with your pulls, let me know in the comments down below or maybe in Macross FaceTime Day Culture or on my Facebook YouTube page. Once again, link in the description. Oh god, I've been repeating that so many times in this episode. Hopefully you guys don't get annoyed by it. <laughs> hey guys. Uh, as usual, let me know if you guys appreciate the content by liking this video. Share the content to all your Utah Macross playing, fr playing friends. And of course, um, comment down below your thoughts on the gacha, the, the episode plate, whatever you have um, that you might want to ask me. And of course, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next Utah Macross video. Until then. Bye!